I never thought you would take over my mind Cause I've been lost But I'm giving you all of my time Isn't that good? So it's our first day in Rome and as you can see we're going really quickly because we have tickets for the Colosseum but it's for like an hour like 8 in the morning 8.30 in the morning So right now we're actually in front of the Colosseum as you can see it's a beautiful morning it's pretty hot for you know February beautiful Colosseum and we have to actually get there because even though we have the tickets um, we still have to get like the printed out ticket so we have to get actually to the line there and yes yeah, let's see what it is we used to be the team we will talk about what a chemistry I can see it in your eyes you don't want to talk anymore I want to get so numb want to get so numb while we enemies We are inside Colosseum, and it's beautiful and it's very big. Yeah. You should know I'm not like others. You should know I'm not Just for reference, we're underground right now, where the gladiators and animals will be held. So yeah. In my dreams, I play fair. I don't make you leave. Oh, oh my God. Is it so hard to love? Only in my head, only in my head I'm the person that should be instead Oh, oh my god I'm too rough around the edges I'm so unrefined Can't make up my mind Cause I'm too rough around the edges Steal and cheat and lie Make my lovers cry now on the above ground level so we actually have a nice viewpoint yeah and it's very sunny very nice weather we're liking it We got the limited edition tickets that got us everything. In the ticket price you actually get to go to the other side where it's only for the people that have the ticket. The underground and everywhere here. Sometimes I feel like we're getting nowhere. So right here is the Oric of Constantine and it's a very known landmark but the cool thing about this is it has like the depictions of famous battles and you know like history. You leave me hanging begging for more Think that I'm addicted to this Can't resist to be a little risky and go For it cause I want you close I'm so exposed when you're keeping me wondering You know i do anything to be in Again. So, give me a so we pretty much circled the Palatine Hill because we circled around we're actually gonna go on top there but hold on to your feelings to you know what you're in for just hold on just a minute okay so everything behind me as you can see like let's just First look at this, all of this, what you see here, all these different um, ancient ruins pretty much. 
and like some of them are huge some of them are just like this one here but basically it's the foro romano this is what is left out of today So right now we are on the Palatine Hill and there's a balcony that can see like the Forum, Roman Forum. And also you can find here a beautiful garden. And right now we are going to see the Circus Maximus from the top. Roman Forum right here. And if we turn around you can actually see the Colosseum right there. You can see we're pretty high up. But it's very cool everything right there and then the Colosseum right there and I can kiss you every day but hold on to your feelings to you know what you're in for just hold on. so right now we're on the balcony and we can see where the circus Maximus used to be it looks like a park but you can kind of see where it used to be like you can see where the middle outline is where the sides would be where the you know cherries would ride say you think about it too when the lights go out and there's no doubt that i should be with that i should be we've been on and off again and again i don't know which way we're going no control you push me then you pull me back in We've been on and off again and again I don't know which way we're going No control You push me then you pull me back in mm -mm -mm. So another beautiful day here in Rome Don't know why we couldn't work this out Because you know I tried the best I could I don't know how or what I could I really tried the best I could I can't stop time for you So, very quickly I just wanted to mention that we're almost at the um, viewpoint but as you can see FG is taking a photo of something very cool here and it's these trees right here I'm gonna show you in a second they are beautiful these trees right here are amazing like they're so beautiful but you can imagine how beautiful they are if there is a proper spring or summer it must be beautiful thought that we were foolish not that we were cruel enough to do it now i feel so stupid don't you feel that too? Uh, don't feel and from here you have the view of the whole Rome from above. We wish it would be a little bit higher we find to see more. Yeah, because it's a little bit low. Right there is the big white building that we saw yesterday. But we're gonna actually come back to it. It's right here. That's the white building. That's the city center. Somewhere there is the Vatican. Okay, so right here is the Colosseum, right here. And like the ancient ruins right here. So you can see some more here. Travestere. Travestere? Trastevere. This is right here.
like the and right now it's a very outgoing place like it's one of the places that people are talking about here in Rome but because we're kind of like in the middle of transition from winter to spring it's not very green and it's a very it's a little bit dull not a lot of things going on right now I guess people are gonna go there after sunset and because of that it's not as beautiful as it was on photos and right now we're going to Aventine Hill which is right behind us right here this is like the place where it is and we're going to the keyhole somewhere there let's see if we can find it it should be very cool let's go We're in a bit of a hurry, but I wanted to show you one thing. We just been to the keyhole. Look at the line of people standing to get to the keyhole. Like literally, that is the line to get to the keyhole that we just been to. And the photo you get from this is gonna be right now. It's very cool, very cool spot, but there's a line to get here. And we were lucky that we got here before it got dark. Italian food, which is called pasta amatriciana. So right now we got into the Bio Park, the zoo in Rome. We paid 16 euro per person. It's adult ticket, and now in February the opening hours are. 17 5. so 5 p.m. So the first animal is giraffe. <laughs> seems a little bit older and it kind of feels like it's in the middle of modernization in some parts so yeah
And right here you can see that we entered the reptile house. It was very cool because it actually showed the way it should be with the climate, with the weather, the fog and the rain. And because of that my lens got really foggy really quickly. But for the experience it was very good. You actually would feel how it would be in that climate. We are done with the zoo. It was very big. Yeah, I think we didn't expect that. Yeah, we thought it's gonna be much more smaller, especially since it's already in the park, but it's very big. So another beautiful day here in Rome, and today we're heading to Vatican. <laughs> So we finally got to the other side of the barriers from all the way somewhere there all the way to get to the checkout checkout security, security check and now we finally can get inside shouldn't be coming back but somehow we cut back acting drunk even though we're sober we should be good but we keep out of fires the words you keep cause we're scared of the silence we should be good but we keep out of fires fires around ourselves we should be good but we keep out of fires the words you keep cause we're scared of the silence we should be good but we keep out of fires fires around ourselves 307 on, 200 more to go. Three hundred more, my bad. Three hundred four. Three hundred four. Even more, my bad. We made it. It's right there. Right. It's leading to the dome. We're not done yet. We're getting along this thing. So we made it to the top of the dome right now. And the views here are amazing. You can see a 360 panorama of whole Rome and Vatican City. So we just got down from the dome. So right now we're pretty much like walking on a, you know, on a pretty much like a roof. It's kind of funny. It's kind of weird. And there's objects. There is FGX and look how gigantic this all is. Like that is FGX. So this place is huge. I think I would have to have like a huge wide angle lens to even show you how big this is. Like this is so huge. Look at this everywhere. It's astonish astonishingly big. Show me how to dare to love 
So we're done with the basilica and the dome over there on top. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires. The words you be, cause we're scared of the silence. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires, fires around ourselves. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires. The words you be, cause we're scared of the silence. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires, fires around ourselves. It's deja vu. So another beautiful morning here in Rome and today we're heading to Travis Fontaine, Pantheon and some other stuff in the city center We made it! I can see clear through my mind And the secrets to shut my eyes To shut my eyes and see through my mind I can see Cause I feel ready now I see red, I feel blue But it's all black and white It's black and white And in the night I tend to lose my sight I fade out within the moving light But I get time, I get time So right now, what time is it? What time is it? It's like 9... 9.20? 9.20? And there's already people coming, like we've been here way before and it was very nice Yeah, it is empty Yeah, we had like a nice window where it was pretty empty, you could say, like not many people And right now it's starting to get more and more crowded But it's very nice fountain, it's like very big, very huge Very breathtaking, very beautiful looking So the next location we're heading to is gonna be the Pantheon Which should be not far from the Trevi Fountain So right now we are in front of the Pantheon. So right now we're in the Pantheon And it's completely free There's no price, only maybe a line But today there is no line, it's February And one thing that I think stands out about this dome About this Pantheon is the open dome As it's not really often that you see something like that Where the dome is fully opened Or, you know, basically if it was raining, it would rain inside So there's actually a... Right here a drain That actually would drain the water if there was any rain coming in. So a few steps away from the Pantheon is Piazza Navona. We have a huge fountain. Which is called Fontana dei Fiumi 
and, and like it, that. Yeah, like that. It's right here. Very big, very beautiful. Don't be afraid. The Torre Argentina. And this is actually a cat sanctuary. And as you can see, there are cats here, like this one here. So basically they what they did is take this whole area and turn it into a cat sanctuary. And still there is the ancient ruins. Oh, oh, yeah. Now it's time for something better. So right now we're in front of Altare della Patria. And this is basically a historical monument and it's enormous and very impressive. I can see So right now we're at the very top of the monument and it's huge it's ginormous like any words you describe is not gonna be enough giants could live here <laughs> yeah definitely like this. look at this So right behind us is actually the Colosseum and the Roman Forum that we've been to on the first day here in Rome. Go, let me know. So, oh, oh. what if I just lose my mind? Make a scene and run around. Show you what I feel inside all the time. Hey. What if I just lose? With the monument. At the very top top is a panoramic view and you can enter there by elevator which costs 10 euros. What, what time is it? It's 2 p.m. So right now... We are at the Spanish Steps. And there is a lot of people here. There is a lot, a lot of people. Like, just look at this. Look at this. How many people there are in front of the steps. How many on the steps. And then there is actors right here. And then the Spanish stuff here. Is this our destiny? Just like it was meant to be. Yeah.
in the Villa Borghesa Park and the reason for that is that we are waiting for the sunset to come to Trevi Fontan by night. Go, let me know, so oh, oh. what if I just lose my mind, make a scene and run around. So right now we are on the Piazza del Popolo. So right now is the third time we're here by the Trevi Fountain. We've been in the morning, it was empty. In the middle, it was very like crowded, and now it's even more crowded, but it looks beautiful. It's all right. Our wings wouldn't fly. It's all right. If we are crashing, so today is the last day here in Rome, and we're starting off the day where we started the first one, which is by the right there. Pieces of love, it's all right. Scattered in mud, it's all right. You're giving me a lot. So, right now, we are at Circo Massimo and Right here is where the stadium used to be. Right now we're standing on, as you can see, like this ridge over here. You can see is where the, kind of like the remainings of the stadium are, pretty much all that is left here. And there will be like a stadium on this side, all the way 360 degree on the, both sides. So right now we are at the Orange Gardens with the scenic terrace view. We head for the sky, it's all right. Our wings wouldn't fly, it's all right. If we are crashing down again. Pieces of love, it's all right. Scattered in mud, it's all right. You gave and we were actually heading towards Crastavere once again. We wanted to try two things. One of them is the Supli, and other is a very highly rated ice cream, gelato, in Rome. Supli. Let's try this out. Good? This is so good. And here we have mozzarella, rice. Meat. Meat. It's amazing. Yeah, and tomato sauce. It's very yeah. good. And we paid 150 per per one. Per one. We held on to the tide. To me it was clear, but you lied to me. No, I keep thinking, was I wasting my time? Letting you into my life mm -hmm. So that's gonna be it for today the last day here in Rome and it was a beautiful adventure We got to see a lot. We did a lot. We did almost 100 kilometers on foot here in Rome during that week Which is a lot in my opinion And we did a lot. We did actually see I think almost everything we wanted to see 
that's gonna be it for this video. But before we end this video, a couple things that I wanted to mention very quickly. First off, if you like the music in this video or in any other of my work, check out Epidemic Sound. It's gonna be linked down below. If you just sign up through that link, you'll get 30 days free. Second off, if you would like to support our channel, check out my Patreon and my website. If you choose to become our Patreon, well, there are things coming back your way because we send out monthly postcards from the places that we visit. And last but not least, if you want to join our travel community, check out Travel the World. It's a Facebook travel community. If you're into that kind of stuff, check it out. It's gonna be a link down below. So, we hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like Comment. and subscribe. We hope you guys enjoyed this video once again and we'll see you next time. Pieces of love, it's all right Scattered in mud, it's all right You're giving me a lie again